Other evidence shows that there is energy occurring naturally everywhere on the planet that our science knows about but seems to ignore. Nikola Tesla sought to provide the world with free wireless electricity for everybody on Earth. He discovered that electricity occurred naturally throughout the Earth's atmosphere and ground. The telluric currents in the ground that John Burke discussed and the electricity present in the ionosphere in the atmosphere which is ionized by the sun he also created and developed ways to harness those energies. Tesla, who would teach Nikola Tesla to get to that power of electricity? And he, 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 he didn't invent it, it's already there, but he know how to use it. And not only that, he did not take an advantage like Mr. Addison. Tesla wanted to harness the natural energy that exists everywhere on Earth and make it free to the public. Edison endeavored to produce and distribute electricity by creating a regulated monopoly for profit. He became rich and the people more light into their home. Yeah, so Nikola Tesla is the one to uh, think of how to use this energy. Between 1901 and 1917, the Tesla Tower was built on Long Island as a wireless broadcasting system for telephone and electrical signals. Interestingly, it was constructed on an aquifer with descending passageways and tunnels beneath it. At the time, few understood how it worked. Tesla's funding was ultimately dropped by J.P. Morgan because Tesla wanted the wireless electricity to be free and therefore J.P. Morgan couldn't make a profit. So even though Tesla's genius was seen by many, he was still driven into obscurity. The energy to create free wireless energy has always existed on our planet and still exists today.